Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Friday, August the 12th, and it's a national holiday. Actually, it's a world holiday, but it counts. <laughs> so today's world holiday is World Elephant Day. <laughs> so I'm gonna just cute little elephant. It's so cute. I love him so much, or her. <laughs> I made it pink because in a town next to me, there's a giant pink elephant statue. If I can find a picture of it, I will pop it in. <laughs> and uh, it's pretty popular around here. Like everybody knows about this pink elephant. Um, but I saw I thought I'd make it pink just to match that elephant. So this is a free pattern. It's called Mini Elephant Amigurumi by Super Gurumi, I believe is what it's called. Is it the Super Gurumi or Super Amigurumi? I think it's Super Gurumi. But I'll link it below either way. So you can download it if you want. It is made in quite a few pieces though. Uh, the body and head is one piece. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven pieces. <laughs> Lots of sewing. So if you don't like sewing, I wouldn't recommend this pattern. But it's super cute. I think I might have sewed the ears a little too close to the face, but it's still really cute. But it's so sweet. Um, I used Red Heart Super Saver pink. I'm not sure what the color is. It's just their pearl pink. And then the little um, tusks are Erin. And then I used 12 millimeter eyes, I think. They're 12 millimeter. And it's just so cute. It's the sweetest sets up. And I just thought it would be cute to make today since it's World Elephant Day. So I will leave its little pattern linked below if you want to check it out. And, um, yeah, I might put this in my Etsy shop eventually. I've been saving up amigurumis to try to either put it in my Etsy shop or eventually do a, um, like a craft fair. So this will probably be in there. <laughs> but I just thought it'd be cute to make a little elephant today and share it with you guys. So here he is. So cute. I love the little trunk. When I first made it, I was a little skeptical of the way it was looking because a lot of times amigurumis look weird before you put them all together. And that first thing I attached was his trunk because, <laughs> um, I thought it'd be easier to put that in the middle of the face and then work around it. And at first I was like, that looks really weird. I don't know if that's going to look out, come out looking like an elephant. But as I started putting all the pieces on there, it did look really cute. And I like it a lot. I think it's really cute. I believe this same person has a bunch of patterns of similar size and shaped animals, but they're different animals. Because I'm pretty sure I've seen them on just, you know, looking around at patterns before. But I will leave this one linked below if you want to check it out and um, make it. But yeah, so that's my elephant. <laughs> I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye guys.